Hello everybody and welcome back to Nightmares from the Deep, the Cursed Heart. It is exactly two months to the day since the last time that we've tried to save our daughter from a ghost pirate. And uh, here's, here's hoping we remember what we're doing. Uh, we are, well, I'm sure we can figure it out because we're two of the best hidden object players in the world when it comes to aquatic themed hidden object games. We're your hosts. My name is Michael. Amanda. <laughs> it's Amanda. <laughs> And uh, she's got the mouse and is ready to get us investigating. Am I? Oh my goodness. Right into a cutscene. See how good we are? We found our daughter. We found the ghost pirate. It's the end of the game. Mm. Hey, wait a minute. Now, hold on now. That's a troll face, I guess. What does a troll face have to do with a pirate? Oh, is this something we're going to have to do? Do we have to tr remember what that face looked like and trace it? Uh, I mean, you can still see the face here. Looks like there used to be a painting here. Maybe if I repair it, I'll be able to get inside. So we're going to find pieces probably scattered around and then just glue it back together. Oh, okay. Well... I think those little green sticks are probably just, you know, to help you figure out where the shape is supposed to go in. Maybe. All right, I guess. Well, we'll we can look for it. Well, you know all those home security firms that are locking <laughs> doors with missing paintings? It's impenetrable. Oh, I'm so glad we came back. Oh, look. There's a thing. Rusty. We need to oil it. All right. We don't have any oil. That's not a thing that works in real life, by the way. Oiling a gondola? Oiling rusty things which is like a cure-all in hidden object games that uh -huh. are always making you do that and it doesn't actually work that way in real life. What are you supposed to do in real life? I mean, you can oil things, it just won't always work if they're very damaged. I mean, or... you can oil a glass of milk. <laughs> it's not gonna help. But what are you supposed to do with a rusty piece of machinery? Like, there's special chemicals that you put on it. Like, oily milk? No, not like oily milk, you crazy person. This is outside of my area of expertise. What I'm really good at is finding chunks of demon face paintings. <laughs> well, good, because we need to. What is this? The steering wheel is incomplete. Quit giving me more things to look for and give me some of the things that I'm looking for. What's at the bottom of that? Uh, okay. I need to find a way to open this mechanical mouth. Oh, maybe you by sticking some gears in its eyes. What's at the base of the pillar there? That is a clue that's telling us that we should go backwards. Oh, I see. It's like a hint. It's like, you don't know how to solve any of this stuff. Get out of here. Yeah, basically. Hmm. Right, right. Ghoulish glow. Yeah, yeah, someone's up in the tower. The they don't glow like that normally. I forgot the pirate's name was Remington. That's weird. Well, pirates are known for stealing, so he's... Remington Steel. Okay. <laughs> no! No! You don't get away with that. You don't get to pass that off. Let's talk to the dead skeleton again. No, we're gonna go look at the cave? Yeah, let's go look at the cave. I'm trying to remember what we need to do with this. Uh, okay, we need a up. light. Alright. I don't think they'll talk to us. No, oh, no, he helped us out. He helped us blow that door open, and, and that's it. Okay. We're in full-on retreat mode, just going all the way back down the mountain. Leave me alone. I'm trying to rest in peace. Right, that one talks. You shut your dumb face. You had two months off where we didn't talk to you at all. <laughs> two months we stayed away from this game. Uh-huh. Oh, let's go rob a grave. Again. Again. We keep coming back here. There's so much good stuff. I guess. <laughs> Do you know what a fishbone looks like? Yeah, don't you? It I know what like a fish a... skeleton looks like. Oh, you know they mean that. Mm. A portrait. Um, I guess it's here? The, the... Oh, no, that's a beetle. No, I just mean that it's something that you're going to have to put back into this frame, I right. think. Right, so you were thinking it's... it was that hanky under the key? It's in that... You flipped it over? Yeah, but it's not. I'm clicking on it, it's not no. doing anything. Um... You can grab the cutlass while we're at it. The portrait's in yellow, which means we have to do something extra to like it. Like get the key off it? No, the keys are also a special thing where you got to put them all in the key loop. <laughs> what kind of obsessive is our protagonist? <laughs> Can't just pick up loose keys? The worst kind. Oh, here's the portrait. Oh, the bet. portrait's inside the little... Oh, it didn't have anything to do with this frame. No, nope. I feel silly. All right, well, do you see clover? I mean, like, 
the four leaf kind or just any of that green stuff up at the top? I think it's got to be a special kind or they wouldn't, you wouldn't have anything They wouldn't make a big on. deal out of it? Yeah. I bet it's a drawing of clover. I bet they're being cheap like that. Could be, could be. Alright, what else? Oil can, is that this? Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> it's giant. How about the frame that we're looking at? The I spiked on dog collar. Uh, the diary right behind it, which is not hidden at all. Why is there a spiked dog collar in here? That looked extremely modern. They know we took two months off. They're trying to, you know, ease us back in. <laughs> They're like, here, you know what a book looks like? Do you know what a frame looks like? Seriously, though, where's the clover? I'm going to feel really dumb. It's, it's very obvious, I'm sure. Hmm. Hmm. No, there it is. I told you it would be a drawing. I told you they'd be cheap. You were right. You have a second sense for these things. Okay, so with the oil can, we can go back and oil the rust or our milk. Oh, that's right. Right, right, right. We want to turn back time. Was there something you were supposed to do on the wall? <sighs> Which wall? Back in the crypt. Um... I think we're looking for portrait pieces, but we have only found, like, one. Man, there are so many portraits we're supposed to put together. Right? I guess we can drop this one off. Looks like. Our fingers are lighter now. Remington. He tore the painting which I haunt. Bummer. He remembered me as a young girl. Now he's insane. Planning to set infernal powers in motion once again. Help him. Help him set Find the map marking what? the way to the treasure and look for other portrait pieces. <coughs> you don't portrait. have to tell us, lady. We're going to put everything we can find into our pockets. Portrait. Portrait. Hey, look, our disembodied hand is taking notes. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, ourselves. Okay. Uh, I think Why we're does that here. dead portrait lady want us to help the pirate? She was in love with him when she was alive. And she doesn't even hold it against him that he tore up her portrait. I guess. The um, cycle of abuse continues. Right, out here. And then the gondola. Right. And then this and this thing. shouldn't work, but will work. Oh yeah, milky. <laughs> uh, now we get a cutscene? Yep. So we have left the t occupied tower to go somewhere else entirely. I'm so glad that they CGI rendered that two second clip of us crossing the water in the gondola. Because it really would have messed with my immersion if we hadn't seen that. I would have been like, how did we get here? Hey, hey, come back here. Poke every ghost I want to. They're not stable. It's their problem. Let's put a leather Locked. flap over it. It's still got rusty. Hmm. Do you have any more oil? Nope. We are out. You know that every... Oh! Oh! I'm wrong! I started to say, you know everything's only one use in these games, but I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Yeah, some ginger. <laughs> Small loot the lighthouse key, but I don't want to cut my hand breaking the window. No problem, just use that bolt cutter, lady. It doesn't matter what, as long as it's long and metal and keeps your hands out of it. Yeah, but she won't use it for that. Nope, That's, I need something I else. I swear to God that'll work, lady. <laughs> Throw the oil can at it from a distance. Yeah, no. Everything has a specific use, and you cannot use anything else for that specific use. Why are we leaving when we just determined that you could put oil on that rusty lock? Because I want to see if there's anything else over here. The huh. statue once held something, but it's missing the object and its hand. It was probably holding bolt cutters. <laughs> to commemorate that one time that one guy with the bolt cutters cut a bolt. There's shipwrecks over there. They still talk about it on this island. It was literally the only <laughs> thing that ever happened out here. All right, we'll go in here first and do this thing. I know it's not going to work. Wait, this isn't going to work because we need a key. What are you I talking know. about? I don't know why you bothered to come back. I, because you told me to. I forgot My that you were... My idea was so blatantly dumb. I forgot that you're full of shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm glad I had the chance to remind you. <laughs> it's 
too far away to reach. Use the pliers. No, nope. you're not gonna let me. Throw a root at it. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, what else is here? Kick over those rocks. How dare somebody balance something when we're around here? That's right. Knock them down. We're keeping this one. Huh. I won't be messing around this grave without good reason. One end <laughs> undead pirate is one too many. Oh. I mean, with a good reason, I'll desecrate any grave. <laughs> Several times. I mean, she is an archaeologist, so that's kind of her thing, really. Yeah, I don't know who she thinks she's fooling. Alright. So we can't uh, go past else? it under that shipwreck? No, it's kind of just this. Um... The pirates used the lighthouse to lure ships onto the rocks, then loot their shattered wrecks. Boy, those are some rough customers, those pirates. It's not bad work if you can get it. It's exactly bad work. It's very bad. It's a I bad thing that they were doing. Hell yeah, special rock. <laughs> Much better than the other hard things we already had. Haven't they ever heard of hiding the key, like, on the door sill or under a rock somewhere? Who puts it visible in a window? I might as well put up a sign that said, also, please come in and rob me while you're at it. Well, pirates, even though they stole from other people, were not that vigilant about being stolen from themselves. So, mm. they just, they're real naive, those pirates. New objective figurine. I don't want another objective. I'm tired of objectives. Just start giving me stuff. Look, sure, our daughter was kidnapped. But think about it. In the real world, if you came across a statue with a picture of what it was supposed to look like and a whole kit that you could just put together, how could you possibly resist? Cleary. Cleary? The statue is missing an arm. Cleary. You know, Beverly Cleary, mm -hmm. author of the Ramona books. Are you really walking away? <laughs> I'm not building your dumb statue. We don't have the stuff we need. It's all right there it on the table. said it's missing an arm. The arm was on the table. Oh, it's been two months, people. Please <laughs> forgive us. We don't even know how to recognize a puzzle anymore. I want to do this one. <laughs> <laughs> Is the cork wineskin that uh, thermos-looking thing in the underneath the pipe? In the emerald. Um, Go this? down from the emerald. This? Yeah. I need a cork. Okay, so I was right. It's almost a corked wineskin. Is that a cork in the gear? Oh, yep. Yes, I think so. Alright. Well, bam. Okay, now where's the pouch that these jewels go in? Uh, jewel pouch, A. Eh? Is it that? That's a cleaning oh, cloth. That's something else. Hmm. Um... Some, they claim that they have fit an entire sea monster in here. Well, you know it's going to be art or a carving or some bullshit like that. Is that a little bat? A little bat. I think it's a bat, yeah. yeah that's kind of cute. Neat. Alright. Um, what do you want me to do yeah, with this? Yeah, why do you keep enough with the mirror? It's not complete. How does one complete a mirror? Because, oh, it's got oh, two broken pieces. i to find broken glass pieces. I guess. Okay. Let's see, gem pouch, cork screw, spider web. Sp the spider web's kind of by the compass, right? Yep. A white die? I saw that. It's under the chest piece on the gear. <clears throat> a barrel, a crank, a. Hmm. I feel like I saw the crank too. It's right here. Some loose rolling to Is that the map? Yep, that's the map. I guess though all the loose gems you're supposed to pick up. You think you can't pick them up until you've identified what the sack is? You can pick them up, but you have to put them down in the exact place at once. I see. You can't just You can't just make a pile somewhere. No. Is this Other? the pouch? Is that it? Yeah. That's it. That's all it. right. Does that one not count as a gem? That's that clearly a gem. Drink? Nah. No, that's in a setting, so it doesn't count as a gem anymore. <laughs> now it's jewelry. Okay. Alright, I guess that was all that. of them. 
So what's in the book? Is that where the sea monster's hiding? <laughs> it's a pop-up book. <laughs> okay, that's kind of charming. What is this? Uh, something to do with the corkscrew? Oh, it is the corkscrew. It's a flip open corkscrew. Okay. Alright. Um, and they showing us the last glass for the mirror over yeah. there. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. And a barrel. It's in the back. Alright. Alright, you think that we have everything we need for this? Because yeah, that's yeah. not how these games They gave you work. three arms and they want you to look at the picture and pick up the one with the trident because that's... See, if I if we have everything we need here... It should be clickable and it's not. It should be clickable and it's not. But the head and the arm are right there. It looks like we There's could... two heads here. There's three heads here. Yeah. There's a bunch of arms here. They're not all to this. I thought it was just mapped to the picture. But we are missing the uh, conch shell horn. Yep. That arm is missing. That's the arm that's missing. That's what she was saying. You can never just do something. You always have to go find shit for it. Well, then pick up that part of the wheel that we're supposed to get while we're here. All right. First, let's find out about <laughs> what a great day it was for pillaging. Oh, I love the happy-go-lucky guy. <laughs> oh, 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 what a great day of pillaging. <laughs> Captain used to have the greatest ideas. Building this fake lighthouse was the peak of our plunder years. A lucky pirate could sit here all day, dry and warm, guiding civil ships onto the neighboring reefs and shallows. After that, all he had to do was illuminate the skull with the lighthouse flame. That pretty much scared surviving sailors to death. Then the other mates finished the job. There's a lot of stabbing and murdering. <laughs> and collected the loot from the wreckage. No harm, no foul. But everything's different now. Captain's changed since he met that pretty countess. He's not eager to drink and rob with his old crew anymore. He's lost his head for Mary. I miss the good old days. <laughs> I haven't had someone's stomach flop out over my wrist when my cutlass was buried through their spine in months. <laughs> um, yeah, I can fill this beaker with oil. I well, guess you could. I, you have yeah, more oil, that's right? a thing I can do, I guess. I oh, know, our oil's gone. Oh, uh, yeah. Cool. Uh, uh, oil, oil, oil. I mean, wait. Actually, it's not gone. It's oh, it's just our uh, our inventory got too big. Boom! Oil it up. And then it should yeah. take a while to cool. burn through all this oil. I need something to start the fire. Uh, uh. Okay. I don't think we have that. No, we don't. Unless we bang that bolt cutter against something and cause a spark. <laughs> That will not work. You know it won't. Nope. Um, is that the... Oh, that's the dark eye. Uh, I bet once we light this thing up, we can point it into the cave. Yes, that's the deal. That's what we're supposed to be doing. Why is that book leaking slime into a bucket? I don't know. I guess it's supposed to be like mildew. Mm. Or Spanish moss sort of is all clinging yeah, and maybe. dripping from this stuff. There's... Oh, it's glittering because it wants us to leave this place. Thanks for yeah, that. Yeah, we're done. I wish we could take that ore. I feel like that could come in handy. I would like to have a big smacky ore on hand, just in case something comes up, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess this is it. Um, is there anything we can do over here? Did we get anything long that we could use to fish out the thing in the... I don't think water? So. No, it doesn't look like Nothing it. Nothing to give us extra grip. <sighs> yep, I think we are screwed for here right now, too. Mm -hmm. Back on the gondola, I guess. Yeah? Wait. What do I need to do? Oh, I have to actually turn the crank. Turn the crank. Oh my god! The gondola's <laughs> mechanism has broken. No, I should fix it if I want to return. <laughs> the gondola's <laughs> mechanism. <laughs> You mean with this crank handle that you gave me? Yeah, and the gear. Luckily, our pockets are full of the exact crap we need to go back. Uh, Did they expect us to turn around immediately and not have that stuff on hand? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, we stripped that whole island for parts. This isn't our first rodeo. We know the deal. Um, I think we have something that goes here. Yeah, one of the eye gears. All right. Wish. <laughs> and we have a thing that goes here. Right, another piece of the wheel. Okay, and... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Making progress. Yeah. 
are we though? Hey, look. It's that's the, the same, same thing. Statue. Yeah. Let's break off this arm and then find a way to shrink it. <laughs> oh boy. Hit it with the bolt cutters. I don't think that's the way to go. What's um, up, Bony? Where are we going to find... You know, it keeps giving us stuff when we come in here. Not not this time. Hi, hey, I need a source of fire. How about one of these mini candles? Nah. Yeah, these candles are lit. She even comments on it. Can I have them? We didn't get them? any other scraps, did we, for the painting? No, we didn't get anything else. Hmm. Pliers of root. Where are we supposed to take the pliers to? Check the map. Uh, yeah, okay. We're here. We just need to go back down to the pier. Oops. Oops. So we're almost there. Right. Um. Right. Yeah. Got right that. Way. Remember that. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, can we? Pr we can pry that the other eyeball off the. Oh. The other gear eyeball. Thank you for making me do this individually, game. You gotta get your money's worth. Yeah, I wouldn't feel like I was interacting if I didn't have to click on each nail. Alright, the lighthouse is almost completely ruined. Almost. We're here to finish the job. Yep, yep, yep. Hike, hike, hike. Man, can you imagine? This lady is getting in so many steps. <laughs> Her Fitbit has looped back around to zero. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Just Westworlded us. I should place the gears on the bolt so they'll force the spring to open the mask's mouth. You could just ask nicely. Consent <laughs> is important. Um, let's see. Sure. No, that's too small. It needs to go there. There you go. Alright, how about this? this? You don't think it's supposed to be like two aside? Because there's another big silver gear. Yeah? Maybe all the silver stays on the left, I think. Oh, yeah. And then all the red stays on the red side. Oh, well, they really make it elementary for you, huh? Maybe. Assuming it's the same configuration on both sides? Uh, maybe not. Yeah, that's not gonna work. It'd be a little too easy if they... Can I put this back, please? No, uh, just move it to a different... Uh, oh, it's, oh, it's got to go to its original. There we go. No, that doesn't fit nope. either. Nope. Hmm. Shall I skip? I'm still trying to figure out, like, where is it supposed to touch the spring? Because they're not... It's not catching on the spring at all. I don't know. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I guess I'm supposed to put another yeah. small one? Yeah, yeah. Definitely. And the big one. There we go. Oh, okay. Now stick your hand in there, lady. <laughs> what? I still have to do more shit? Stick a root in there. Maybe it's going to give us root juice. It's not. Like a big nutcracker. This is all we have, you dumb mask. <sighs> All right, what needs to get nut cracked? <laughs> All right, um, other thing. We need to go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Isn't that this? Is not that here? Yeah, this is where we are. What? What do you want, then, game? We don't have any more of this. What if we put the wedding invitation in there? Maybe it's like, it stamps it like a time clock. Oh my god. Yeah, you know how you can design a mask to know exactly what's written on a piece of paper? <laughs> Using only pirate technology? <laughs> it makes perfect sense. Oh yeah. Okay, remember, don't poke this ghost because they fall apart. Don't poke this ghost. Oh my god, they're so gentle. <laughs> they're fragile. Hi. These these ones aren't. What's up, stock photos? 
Let's do this first in case this is yeah, relevant. Yeah, let's steal some stuff. Construct a useful item. One more thingy. Oh, so useful. Stone hand. Is Can't... that supposed to be out where the gondola was? The guy who's holding the thing and missing a hand? I don't I no. I think we got a Maybe? gondola back out to the island. Oh, here's the and thing then, that we used to pull that yeah, thing in. Yeah. Down by the docks. Alright, these people are gonna want to talk. So Alright. Let's get chatting, get it over with. We called a truce among all pirate companies for the duration of Captain Remington's wedding. Pirate it was supposed to be a great ball for all the sea wolves in the Caribbean. Oh, we left our weapons on the that? ships as an act of good faith. So when Baron Bannister's soldiers showed up, we were defenseless. They yeah, butchered us <laughs> without hesitation. <laughs> Men and women, innocent and guilty alike. But now, <laughs> Captain Remington is back at last, and he will avenge us so that we may finally rest in peace. By making sure none of you are innocent. <laughs> the festivities were beginning when the soldiers rushed in. Guns blazing, this is swords our protagonist. slashing at the crowd. It was a massacre. The grimmest wedding I ever attended. And the last one, too. But tonight, the captain has appeared with a new girl on his arm. Maybe he has found a way to recreate the wedding somehow. How would that help anything? Your plan doesn't make any sense, lady. It's not her plan, it's the pirate's plan. And I'm not really surprised that pirate plans are not, you know, logical and sensible. Alright, one last... My dude. sword was useless when the slaughter began. Okay. It was on In the ship. blink of an eye, the wedding guests were dead or dying. The pirates. Just before my own <laughs> death, I saw the Countess crying as her treacherous father rescued her. No and <laughs> chained up Captain Remington for execution before her eyes. Because he's a pirate. But now, the Captain's voodoo gimmicks might prove useful. And we will see the Countess and him walk down the aisle once again. Maybe you'll finally be able to lower your right arm. <laughs> you stock illustration of a pirate. Alright, the stairs are collapsed. The fortress had to be fired on. From the ship's cap cannons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. That's fine. The once stately ballroom still carries the scars of the fight, or rather massacre. I don't... Wait, I mean, someone came through and lit all these candles. Yeah, once again, all these candles that we can't pick up to use for the fire that we need. <sighs> well, they blow out by the time we get there. That just makes sense. It does not make sense. <laughs> you know it doesn't make sense. <laughs> Alright, back to Gondola Island. Oh, no, no hand crank this time. Nope. Well, you know what you're doing. You know. Alright, um, was it in here? Uh, no, it was it was where we were before. Oops, I overshot. Okay, so like here. Right. He's got his hand now. Here's your hand. Boom. And uh, we don't know what he was blowing. <laughs> you want a boat yeah. hook? <laughs> Are you using your mouth to stoke a fire? <laughs> it's not a poker, it's a boat hook. Is it? Hmm. Alright, so first we'll use this to do this thing. Yep. Um, what's in here? What can we steal? Uh, something. I feel like Indiana Jones playing an archaeologist who just plunders shit with no <laughs> regard for its historical value. <laughs> Torn page and lens. Well, okay. Right. Not, not one of the many pieces of things that we're supposed to be looking for, but sure. Wait, uh, there's a multicolored Fisher Price xylophone. <laughs> There have been several modern things, like a spiked dog collar, among all this supposed stuff that hasn't been uh, touched in 200 years. What are you holding? Is that a bone or a... I don't know. Or... Oh, the xylophone's on the list, by the way. So. Is it? Okay. So is that shadow of a manta ray underneath the albatross? Wait, that's, is that an albatross? What is that? Pelican. Pelican. The shadow underneath it is the manta ray. 
Do you know what a cockade is? I don't think I know what a cockade is. This is the first time my vocabulary has been stumped by one of these games. Mm -hmm. Honestly, kind of exciting. <laughs> I want to know what a cockade is. Mm -hmm. Is it like a colander? Because there's a blue colander right in the foreground. Nope. Nope. Well, I mean, they had a letter in common, so that wasn't a bad guess. Sure. All right, steering wheel, tambourine. Tambourine. I can see like a loot. There's a tambourine. Okay. Uh, a book, a boot. We could always do mahjong instead. <laughs> There's the bug. Yeah, that's okay. Uh, a boot, a mug. The mug is half full of sand by the hermit crab. Yeah. Where'd you say there was a loot? Uh, back behind the pelican. The belt is right up front here by the compass. Uh, okay. To the right, yeah. It's not like a puka shell belt. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a puka shell uh, necklace is a cockade. Nope. nope. <laughs> Maybe a cockade is a kind of dragonfly. I'm going to guess it's this. Whoa! <laughs> nice. So it means a ribbon. You know, like a prize ribbon. Like it's kind of like brocade, right? Isn't that also something similar? I mean, brocade is a kind of fabric style. Hmm. So not really. Like an embroidered fabric. I don't think it's related. Alright, uh, so what have we got and what can we do with it? I uh, guess we, we gotta can... run another wheel piece all the way back. Uh, is this a teleporter <laughs> no. map? Did we discover that it's not? I don't think it is. We uh, gotta walk. More steps. <laughs> Wait, it also said there was something at the top of the tower. Since we're here. What? Oh, there's another. Cool, cool. The mouse traps in the lower right. Oh god, I don't know what a windrose is either. I th they have really kicked it up. <laughs> okay, two pieces of flint are. Mm. Uh, I don't know. Is that rock over there, flint? Yes, it is. Yep. Great. So, is that bat made of flint? The bat. <laughs> no, there's another rock down at the bottom by the cigarette. Oh, yeah. All right. Um, the jewelry, the earring, is on the list. The horse, they mean the chess piece. The that's a little bit cheap. Yeah. Ah, that's a windrose. It's the legend on a map. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see, a ruler. Hmm. Uh, is it a tape ruler, maybe? The coil? Nope. Dang. No, here it is. Oh, there's a straight ruler. A flute. Oh, I saw that broken thing. It's uh, yeah, right there. A nest full of eggs in the upper right. A mug, which is in the middle. A bolt. What kind of mm. bolt? Metal bolt? Crossbow bolt? That's a thimble. Oh, it's this. Yeah, there's a bolt. A key. Right here? In a ball. You didn't really try to hide any of those. No, they're just. Here's some things to click on. <laughs> yeah, click on these things. Uh, so we can use the flint to start a fire. And then we'll be able to get into the cave. Hooray! Alright, and then. I guess. No, don't how even is have that? to add it. It's just nearby. Just. Maybe it leaks out the bottom? Is I there guess? like a connecting piece? I guess that's what we're supposed to be presuming. I don't really see it. I've never run a lighthouse, so I don't really know. Huh. Oh yeah, now steer it. Uh, oh, we got one of those. Yeah. I didn't know what it was. Uh, I don't think I do need to recreate it. I, I think, think it's, it's just, just rotating a light. until it lines up, right? There's no, uh, there's no swapping around, is there? I think there is. Oh, this damn it, they're fit. swapping around. Oh no, oh, that fits. Yeah. It's just rotating until it lines up. That's fine. That's not the worst. It's going to make us a crazy demon face. Mm. How many crazy demon faces are we going to deal with in this game? <laughs> That's the one piece I can't stand for. <laughs> I think you just had it, actually. No? Oh, you're right. Boom. Is that it? That's uh, it. That looks it. Yeah. I think they're lighting up when I finish them, maybe? Mm, no, they're no. not, because that one's right, and that's not lit up. Mm -hmm. How does this one go? You went past it. It was like four back. 
Is that it? Oh, there it is. I don't know why that one puzzled me. Because it's a puzzle. Mm. <laughs> uh huh. I was pretty sure those hand shapes are supposed to be the same on both sides. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> maybe do they, one? They don't fit. Well, yeah, okay. it does. Kind of. All Mostly. right. Well, this is. These are all right. So what's the problem? Something's uh, not right. Huh. This one looks right. This one looks maybe right. Maybe it's that white one in the middle doesn't really line up. Oh, you're right. Nope, still. Hmm. You're like off this about one? another one? There it yep, is. Yep, there we go. We have solved your slow rotation puzzle. The eye hole is now brightly lit. Hooray! Yeah, shine it right in his eyes. All so right. we can drop off a steering wheel on the way to the cave. Yep. Alright. Crank, crank, crank. Oh, wait, this is something else. That we have no pieces for. Another wheel. Bada boom. Still need one more at least. Maybe two. Depending on how long you want to drag this out. Yep. Uh, right down. And then over to the. Yeah. There we go. Alright. Now let's really stretch our arms into the cave. <laughs> how are we doing this? I don't know. Alright, so somewhere here is another steering wheel. And a mug of beer? <laughs> I can see a chameleon. <laughs> it's doing its chameleon job. Is it on the list? No. no. <laughs> Come on, man. I spotted That's a chameleon. A cute little bonus, though. Yeah. Steering wheel, mug of beer, where you need to combine a mug with the beer. Yeah, where's the beer? Maybe that pony keg is hovering over. You know what that is? Mm. Yeah. Is. Oh, right. imagine how rank that must be. <laughs> <laughs> she just chucks it out the door cave mouth and into the river anyway. That's a button. That's there's a button. A, there's a glass eye in somebody's head. Mm -hmm. I bet. Is there a skull we can rotate around? There we go. A slingshot. A sparrow. Mm -hmm. Another button somewhere. There's the steering wheel anyway. There's a hedgehog up here. <laughs> How'd you get up here, hedgehog? Uh, is there a lamp? Because there's like an Aladdin lamp back here. It's not this. on the list. Oh, the noose. there's the noose. There's so many things from here that I want that aren't on this list. Why right? can't I take the spear? Is and that the a slingshot that you were supposed to uh, It's got kind of a... No, nope. just a bone. Just a bone. <laughs> I Let's thought maybe see. that fork... Man, oh, the slingshot's just up from where you're thinking. Yeah. Any Y shape will do. <laughs> oh, I feel like I saw the octopus. Where'd that octopus go? Oh, it's on the belt buckle. Oh, that's clever. What about the apple? The sparrow's on the hat. It's another drawing. Cheap. An apple? An apple? Is that going to be a drawing too? It's got to be, right? No apple's going to have lasted any time down here. There's no logic to this. <laughs> the egg is right next to the leather hat. There's a bull and a sun. The bull's here. Yeah, two little cheap drawings they didn't even try to hide. Yep. Do you want to ask about that chameleon? Because we... <laughs> All right, one more button and an apple. Um, Maybe they mean like a laptop. <laughs> they do not mean like a laptop. I mean, we've seen some strangely modern stuff. Is that a button next to the frog? There yeah. it is. All right, and then... Oh, the apple is not apple colored at all. It is gross as hell. It's in with the skulls. To the right? Um, Down? Oh, You're that. On wow. Gross. Good eye. And the last steering wheel part. I hope. Um, <laughs> what are we doing? I don't know. This root is very delicate and should be carefully extracted. I already got a root. Yeah, we I don't need no more roots. What do I mean? Okay, whatever. Forget it, roots. Yeah, yeah. Bats, whatever. <laughs> steering wheel. Steering wheel. This better be the end of the steering wheel. Uh huh. Oh, so exciting. What's behind it? What's behind it? The hideout. The hideout. <gasps> Hell yeah, steal everything. 
full of fucking lit candles again. <laughs> <laughs> it's really starting to get to me. That's dangerous. All right, took someone's hair. That's kind of weird. You wanna? Not really. <laughs> okay. This is all just a maudlin pirate talking about wanting to get married. Who cares? Shut up, pirate. Yeah, anytime they try to induce your sympathy for the pirates, it seems pretty risable. Just because I used to help people crash entire ships and then stole everything they were worth and murdered them on the <laughs> on the broken rock of this island doesn't mean I'm a bad guy. Uh, <laughs> I'm quitting the piracy game. <laughs> Jesus. Screw you, dude. You were a terrible person and they were right to murder you. Yep. I mean, it wasn't even murder, it was execution, right? Because he was sentenced to death mm -hmm. for his crimes. <laughs> the map is impossible to decipher without a legend. Like I don't think that's true. I think I think things are drawn to look like what they are. Uh, oh, okay. Whoa. You can establish Wait. where the treasure is buried by strictly following the instructions on the legend. N3. North 3. 2, 3. 3, uh-huh. East one. Okay. In the eye hole? North three. One, two, three. Top of the castle gates. East four. One, two, three, four. All right, out in the jungle. South two. Mm-hmm. You could just say East where five. it is. You just put an X there, dude, like every other pirate. <laughs> Gotta be fancy. Why not make it East seven? Do pirates not... <laughs> Can they not count higher than their hand has fingers? Probably not. I really fear for our pirate educational system. <laughs> no, cool. Let's go into the lighthouse. No, oh, what? <laughs> Twist! Some palm trees out to the east. And then the X is not where we ended up. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we were going to dig there. We totally noticed that. <laughs> Your X that marked the spot worked just fine. Our protagonist, for some reason, didn't want to dig up a grave unnecessarily. Well, we have no such reservations. Some ingredients are missing. I should consult the book. Okay. Some ingredients so for what? We need the, you know, uh, wasabi paste. <laughs> Pretty sure that second one there is wasabi root. So we get some ginger root, which we've already got, some wasabi, uh, some plant there's for the green food coloring, so it'll really set off the color of the sushi. Oh, it just put it over there instead of just doing dropping it off. All right, well, whatever gets it out of my inventory. What I else guess. have we got in our inventory? Uh, we've got this torn page, a lock, lock of, of hair, hair, and the model ship. And it doesn't look like uh, wasabi needs any hair in it, so <laughs> Gross. that's a relief. Maybe something up here will help. Uh, oh, I like this little doll. Uh, the like... glass eye and the button eye is a little bit creepy. Um, I like it. <laughs> How about that box that's staring at us? It looks straight <laughs> up like a D&D &D mimic. <laughs> Not a trap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a thing. What is this for? A clean uh, plate. Clean plate. Okay. So wipe down the plate. There we go. Now we can eat off it. Hooray! Wedding feast time. There's a book. Uh huh. Three books in this one. There's another one. Uh huh. And I don't see the third one here. It'll show up. Is this it? That's it. That's All it. Right. You see how someone just carved the symbol for pie in there, <laughs> and somehow that is something we're supposed to be looking for? Yeesh. Insulting. There's the fang. Uh, it doesn't look like we're supposed to find that ox. Which is another picture. Yeah. Or that vapor wave creeps <laughs> creek statue. <laughs> He's not on the list. There's another bat. There's a scorpion. That's a thing. Oh, there we go. You see a sphere? Just just an orb hanging out. <laughs> uh is that? No. no. Mm -mm. Is that's a magnifying glass up there. Is that on the list? No. Uh no. Wicker oh, a basket bone is the uh, here's the wicker basket. All right, there we go. Uh, shovel. Oof. I think that would be easy to spot. Is it a trowel, actually? Sure. No. We're looking for a hook, too, and a cork. A hook, a cork, 
a shovel. Huh. Not a pickaxe. Right here's the shovel. Oh, that was actually pretty well camouflaged. Good Nicely done. Yeah, Point still in for one. that. Yeah. Uh, is this, this is the hook. Come on. Could the, the bunny's eye be considered a sphere? No. No. Hmm. Uh, so those are to... supposed to go into the candelabra, so where you find those candles, just ram them diagonally <laughs> in there. Yeah. Oh, look at that triangle there. That's kind of a that right angle That's well hidden. Too bad nice they're not looking. asking us to find it. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Oh, the cork is right near the bunny's hand. Oh. Why are you calling this a bunny? It doesn't have ears. Oh, because the, the weighing piece looks like a giant bunny ear to me when I just glance at it. I see. But you're right. Yeah. Not actually a bunny. Is this, is this it now? Okay. And then the sphere was hidden behind it. Um... The drawing of the oh the astrolabe i would not call that a sphere <laughs> see some things we have the vocabulary for all uh -huh, right what's uh -huh. this about part of this lever is missing but the remaining handle is made of bone how spooky oh, i'm so spooked it's, this looks like nothing to me so much as a <laughs> slot for a quarter <laughs> yeah try sticking a quarter in there I don't have any. Try sticking some bubble gum in there so nobody else gets anything and they just lose their quarters. This thick <laughs> curtain is so heavy I won't be able to move it by myself. Hey lady, what if you hit it with a shovel? <laughs> we found a shovel for you. Well, bam. Nope. You can move it with a shovel. Jesus. All right. We're the weakest person on earth. How are we even Our managing to do so all this strange. running around that this game forces us to do? Maybe that's why we can't do anything. We've been hiking up and down these steps all day. Mm, Legs are thing. like jelly. Is there anything else we can get from here? I think we're, I think we're through. It doesn't look like there's like levitating people in that book. Uh, um. I mean, that's not the picture we see, but yeah, it's like somebody's floating. All right, I think we're done here. Okay. So, what have we got in our hands that we're supposed to go drop off somewhere? A shovel. Oh, we gotta go desecrate that grave. Oh, <laughs> alright. Let's go get the treasure. Oh wait, no, the, that's this way. That's off the terrace. Yeah, gotta go to Gondola City. <laughs> and then down to the waterfront. Alright, to the shipwrecks. And then to this grave. That someone was nice enough to put a flower on recently. Um. Dig. Dig fool. I'm try I'm trying. It's not letting me. What the Am hell, I supposed game? to I'm supposed to take this out first. Oh, I see. There's no way we could just shovel through that protected <laughs> flower. Uh -huh. Uh for one coin. A this is single the coin. the worst retirement fund I've ever seen in my life. They really got wiped out by the global economic downturn in 2009. <laughs> 401k's crashed. They took their last remaining coin and just buried it on a beach. We don't have the thing he needs. No. Nope. Unless he's blowing on a shovel. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up to the top just to uh -huh. see if the uh, hidden object scene got reactivated. Nope. Because I, I noticed that this game is not super well designed in the sense that sometimes hidden object scenes will just reawaken even though you have no reason to go to that location again. Right. I think they expect you're going to look at the map, so it's just a crutch. Yeah. Later games by this same developer were better about this, I will say. Like, they were they were more... Wow, we can go all the way back to the boat for an action. Yeah, because we um, can drop this off on the, oh, right, right. in the captain's uh, cabin. In his playset. <laughs> We got a shovel to do that, so. Yep. Careful. Sure. You just <laughs> dug right into it twice. Alright, that's our wasabi root. Okay. And we get to somehow. Look at this mess again. Reach oh, our giant here. arms in here. We emptied our pockets, so we can get some more treasure. Hooray! Alright, so we're looking for some mushrooms, yeah. some handcuffs. Those are manacles, really. The tortoise is right by the rib cage. Mm, yeah. A feather. Ooh, I don't know that I noticed a feather the last time through. It's probably on somebody's hat, right? Yeah, right good. Here. Good, good. An ice pick. Is that this? It looks like an ice pick, maybe. Yeah. Hedgehog, what are you doing with an ice pick? <laughs> 
Uh, some beads? Uh, where's the Mardi Gras beads? Hmm. Alright, uh, also a lamp. Uh, I saw that lamp last time. Yep. How about a snail? I saw a grasshopper. I did not see a... S oh, it's way in the back. On the cave wall. Up from the blue crystals. Or is that a bat? It could be a snail on its this side. This is a bat. It's a bat. Luckily that was on the list. Yeah. But from the side it could also pass for a snail. There's some chess pieces here. Look at that. Oh yeah. That's weird. Alright, uh, a snail. Surely that would be close because they're small, right? I mean, not necessarily because sometimes we've seen them do like metal snails. Mm. Not necessarily in this game. Alright, uh, a, what else? a boot, a, boot. a club, an axe. Nope. The boot is right behind the spear. Alright. Let's see, a mace, a spear, a pickaxe. Yeah, a pickaxe, is that... that doesn't count Not as an axe. Not the same as an axe. Oh, because the axe is like proper Viking style behind the... next to the spear to the left. Um... That is 100% an axe. Oh, there we go. I clicked on it like three times before it registered. I guess the mace is actually a club by the pink crystal. Yep, counts as a club. Cool. Uh, beads and a snail. Oh, I see a scorpion this time I didn't see before. Yep, right there. Hmm. Where's the snail? I mean, he should be easy to spot. He's slow, right? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I mean, he'd almost be easier to see if he was zipping around or something. Is this him? That's not him. That's like a top. That's a cork. It's oh, a you're cork right. on a you're wine right. flask. You're right. Look, would you take a chameleon? Yeah, in trade. Can we just give you the chameleon we spotted? I don't know. Is he the little gray thing next to the skull with the hole in his head? No, it's this. Look. Oh, that is nicely done. Uh, all right. Beads. I think I might hit the, the hint for the beads. It's not that thing in the foreground by the bones, is it? This thing? Yeah. Holy shit, it is. I wasn't sure if that was like a bong or something. <laughs> beads why, it is. Why did you call it metal spike here when you called it an ice pick properly five seconds ago? Look, when a hedgehog is holding it and trying to get your wallet, it's an ice pick. <laughs> but it's a metal spike when you just turn it into a regular tool and not a murder weapon. Alright, where are we going? We're gonna do this, um... Some more alchemy. Some more alchemy. Here. Drop off the wasabi root. Yeah. And these flowers. Yep. And this thing. Alright. I should follow the recipe. To this is all we need? Guy. I guess so. Alright. So um, grind that down. And then go like that to that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And then take the knife to it. <laughs> Nope. No. To it's this. To, yeah, to that. Slices. Yeah, take tweezers to get the petals off the flower. Tweezers? Really? Uh huh. There's no way you could do it with your hands. <laughs> right, Is it going to make you take every leaf off? <laughs> I don't know. Am I supposed to curry it over to here? Am I putting it here? Where am I putting these? <sighs> I don't know. Let me put this Can down. You drop them by the seeds, maybe in the other tray. No, <laughs> I can't <laughs> let this go. Oh man, see, this is why you're supposed to use tweezers, is because they're very adhesive. Wait, what? You okay, notice that the tweezers, doubled the tweezers, yeah, magically come up. I need a pair of tweezers. I think this is bugged. Maybe if we go away and come back. Okay, so any of the pairs of tweezers. <laughs> it doesn't really say where the tweezers are supposed to go, so I was wondering if you're supposed to, you know, do the plucking motion several times? I don't know, this is weird. Keep plucking until there's no more petals left? Uh, I don't know. Um, you just want to move on to the next? Yeah, I just want to see if Alright, so drop on. those seeds in the mortar. Shavings are ready, it seems to want us... Oh, this is this is. You gotta thing. spoon it. All right. It looked like more of a ladle in the thing. And then it's saying three of them. Three? Three scoops. Gotta follow the recipe. 
And then it's three slices of the other thing. The bam. And then four leaves. I am not looking forward to this as much as I was looking forward to making grog. Yeah. So that was it. They didn't think they were going to bother taking the leaves off. Until it or was doing time. any prep until you were dropping them into the order. Which is nuts, because you do all the other stuff in advance. Yep. Alright, now take the eyedropper, one sprit. That said, was several drops. Said one time. Mush that all up, and then stick it in our eyes. <laughs> I forget what this is even for. Green dye. What are we dyeing green? Uh, maybe that demon face painting is... Like we're going to repaint it ourselves? Maybe. Let's see. No, the, the little hint was telling... Maybe. Look. Whoa, you were right. It's for this. That's kind of cool. Uh, to open the door, I have to paint the shape of the demon's features hiding in the shape's lines by clicking them to change the line's position. What? What? Wait, what? Oh, okay. Uh, so it's kind of invisibly rotating? You can't see the full face? It's not really rotating, it's... There's several different options. You're supposed to pick the one that's right. I see. But I don't remember what it looked like. <laughs> you just look for something where all the things kind of line up, you know? I think I look for the skip button. This all is right, silly. there's a full nose. That right. That right. No, oh, that's yeah, right. Yeah, little horns on top. That looks likely. There's the, another little horn. Yep, okay. looking good. That looks okay. That looks all right. Those look fine. Actually, is it okay? Because uh, on the right side, he gets a little spiky horn coming out of his left eye. But his right eye seems to end in a petal. There. Let's skip. This sure. This is silly. Yeah, I don't care. There we go. There, we did have the middle right. Uh-huh. Moral victory. I would have figured it out. Hey, hey, it's our daughter. Just like in the book. The floating lady. Um, cool. Uh, we're going to ignore her and go see <laughs> if we can steal some stuff out of a cabinet. Hi. She's, she's why we're here. I don't know if you remember in the mm. midst of all this maintenance. Maybe in the but... beginning she was why we were here. <laughs> we have found so much cool stuff. I found my daughter, but she's in a magical trance. If Remington put her in this trance, then he can also free her from it. That's not logic. No, it checks out. That's your hope. That's not, <laughs> that's not a fact. If a spider bites you, it can bite you a second time to remove the venom. <laughs> Uh, oh, that's a portrait piece. Okay. All right. I smell a lock on this skull. That Wait. lady, uh, we didn't know you had superpowers. It's a hint because the nose is the lock. They yeah. think they're being clever. That's it's cute. not at all. No. Nobody smells a lock. <laughs> um, well, I guess the only thing to do is this. Uh, huh. Yeah. Okay. It really is voodoo. I guess so. Hey, that frog's back. And he really likes spicy food. <laughs> All right, uh, anyone know what a mandrake root looks like? I think oh. I do, actually. Do you? It's the one that looks, I think it looks like that pirate up there. It's kind of a human-shaped root. See how the thing's got, yeah, that thing with the red. Oh, no, it's the right. That is a mandrake. Uh, okay, that it's was a doll. A doll. <laughs> but the mandrake root looks like a human, which is like. It looks like a vague human shape. Yeah. There it is. That was it. Mm-hmm. I'm like, you could put a hat on a mantrake root if you want. <laughs> a lizard tongue. Just the tongue. Not the whole lizard. Huh. Maybe we Let's maybe we put a pin in that one. Nope, there it is. Oh, I just straight up found it. Him using a tongue as a tie. Uh-huh. Green liquid, which is supposed to take some steps. Maybe if we uh, pulp this frog. If I add yellow fluid to the blue, I'll create a green fluid. All right, so blue plus yellow, green. Uh, fish bones. Like a fish skeleton. There's a snake skeleton. Close enough. Nope. Not yeah. close enough. Is this it? Aha! Yep. How about, how about a gargoyle? So many things look pretty gargoyly. Yeah. Uh, but the one that looks like a bookend. <laughs> a 
That's probably it. Yep. A All pumpkin. right. A pumpkin. You know, it's not Ooh. it's not Voodoo Halloween, so you got a pumpkin somewhere. <laughs> There's a pumpkin. Yeah. All right, skip that one. Uh, a mirror. That's not a mirror. There's a mirror. Yep. Feng Shui mirror. Lizard. Oh, the pumpkin's way up at the top there. Oh, good eye. There's a pouch. An onion. Onion. A green onion, a white onion, a yellow onion. Yeah, I don't know. Oh. Okay, there's Found the lizard. Onion. I see a pin cushion. I see a tarot card. Is it the hero fant? Um, it's the hermit. Hmm. Where? There's another tarot card over there. Oh, that makes sense. Tarot being a voodoo thing. Yeah, everyone knows that. Oh, of course. Do you see an egg? Yes. Where? It's right over there on the shelf. I was looking for an onion. All right, well, I'm going to hint. That's not that's onion. That's garlic. garlic, you Philistines. That is 100% garlic bulbs. This, yeah, there's no ambiguity. That I don't is feel bad about cheating. <laughs> uh, you know, we could just we could just take our daughter and take her to a hospital. That would kind of be more logical than whatever we're doing. Is this where we wrap it up with our daughter suspended in space? <laughs> Do you wanna just, just, just let it just go here? Her. Eh, just watch her waft gently in the breeze there. Honestly, she's no different from a lava lamp at this point. <laughs> Do we need her back? She wasn't all that helpful at the museum. Yeah, she actually caused more problems. Maybe this is fine. This is probably a pretty solid ending. <laughs> this is as good as it's gonna get. All the pirates are dead. And our daughter seems peaceful. And our pockets are full of loot. <laughs> including all the garlic we could hope for. Uh, we've got one gold coin and everything else is worthless. Oh. I feel like we're probably going to be playing this game a little longer. <laughs> Alright, well, if you want to see if we can manage to get some retirement income out of this whole thing, <laughs> and maybe we'll change our mind and actually try and get our daughter back, uh, stick around. <laughs> Hopefully it won't take us so long to do the next chapter. <laughs> Thanks, everybody.